One of the most basic human experiences is the flow of time, right? We all have this sensation that we're all kind of on a river of time that's taking us from moment to moment to moment, endlessly rushing forward toward the future. However common that experience, maybe I have that experience. That's how I think about time in everyday life. But when we look at the equations of physics, we don't find any evidence for a flow of time. All we find in the equations of physics is that there's moment after moment after moment, but there's no sense in which those moments flow into each other. It's as if that river of time is more like a frozen river, where every moment is forever locked into one location, and it's just out there, all of time being out there. It's as if, you know, none of us have a problem with the idea of all of space being out there. We can picture that in our mind's eye, all of space out there. This way of thinking about time suggests that we should also think that all of time is out there too.